someone else to do it. I can't tell you that. But I know OJ Simpson's first time. Uh, I got it? No, no, but it's family. Charles Manson set to walk free. Anthony, what is the family's response to this hearing set to go down in 72 hours? Well, I think it's, it's kind of uh, like with all criminal hearings, our feelings and our thoughts are always with Jay and the other victims. But uh, it is disturbing to see the different uh, attention and outpouring that goes towards the killers and the fascination with the murders. It's been decades and still, people treat the murders as a cash cow. Consumers eat it up like popcorn. Like a fucking king. Now the dead remain faceless props in their graves. This isn't funny, and this is real. There are family members, and there are people who've been affected by it. Helter Skelter. The uh, Manson murders have inspired the making of millions of dollars. The multiple movies that were made, and all the, the rip-offs of the story. Charles Manson was playing the long game. People are dead, Charlie. It became a real cottage industry. Please welcome Charles Manson. I've always wanted to ask all the profiteers and the consumers. Hi, boys. I'm Charlie. If your flesh and blood was treated by the Manson family as ours were. Can't you see she's pregnant? Can't you see that she's pregnant? Can't you see that she's pregnant? Would you take your money? Would you enjoy the show? I'm not a politician. I'm just a bad musician. These t-shirts, they have Manson with the X on his forehead instead of the swastika. And I just always found that interesting because it's like, do the t-shirt makers, or people that are wearing the t-shirts, not want to wear what's truly on his forehead because then they'd be racist? How can you even let your kid out of the house? Or how can you even get up on a stage? Who knows how many people are going to see it and you're proud to wear that? How does that happen? I had a question. Were y'all planning to pull the uh, Charles Manson track off your album? No. Every year, they make anniversaries out of this. And it never let out. There is a true fascination with the pop culture and the zeitgeist of the day, both meeting and even colliding with these killers. You know, the minute you deal with anything about Manson, then it becomes the Manson movie, and that's not really what it what it is. And that's not really what it what it is. Do you have an opinion on how your project is different in comparison, if it is, mm -hmm. to how Jay and Sharon or portrayals of the murders have been? Well, just the idea that I'm just trying to treat Jay and Sharon as characters, I think, makes it different, as opposed to just the victims. They were living, breathing people who were alive and who were here. Jay isn't just this character from my piece, and he's not just this character from true crime history. You know, he was your uncle. 